After months of a ceasefire between the two most powerful criminal gangs in Karachi, violence has once again gripped the volatile Liari area of the city. Police and intelligence officials claim that both these notorious gangs are once again at daggers drawn. But leaders of both the gangs reject these claims. Our correspondent Hassan Abdullah reports exclusively after meeting the two dawns of Liari. Liari has always had its fair share of issues ranging from a strong sense of economic deprivation to the law and order situation. For over a decade, bullets and rockets rained down on the houses of this area as the Rahman Daket and Ashat Papu gangs engaged in bloody wars. However, the gang war finally ended after efforts of the Liari Peace Committee. But once again, violence has resumed in Liari. Police and intelligence officials say there is trust deficit between the two gangs and they have once again pointed guns at each other. But Uzair Baloch and Rafar Zikri, the respective leaders of the two gangs, reject the official claims. Interestingly, some residents of Liari have been accusing Ghaffar Zikri of maintaining a secret alliance, but Zikri denies the charge. अगर मैं कोई सांसी बंदा होता था, तो आज मेरे इलाके में पीपस पार्टी जीतता नहीं था। मेरे इलाके में भी पीपस पार्टी ने कामयाबी आसिल किया। इससे बड़ा सबूत और कुछ नहीं है जो मैं दे सकूं। MQM officials say the gangsters are being used by certain political quarters against the MQM. Well, I'm surprised at the hardcore core criminals, gangsters and murderers of innocent citizens of Leari. They are now trying to tow the agenda of certain influential people of the area who are trying to bring them all, all the criminals into the political limelight. Well, Muttahida Kwami movement is doing just one thing in Leari, which is providing water to the needy, which is doing development work through its city district government and everybody knows that. Regardless of the political reality, once again it's the ordinary people of Liari who are suffering. Some political observers say that this area has been kept embroiled in such issues for political gains. They add that while such a strategy may provide short-term gains, in the long term this strategy would prove disastrous. Hassan Abdullah, Dawn News, Karachi.